As we start creating more complex games, we often run into the situation where we have quite a few attributes describing a particular object in our program. For example, if we were doing an adventure game, we would have statistics such as the character's name, the character's sex, the character's hit points, which would be the maximum health of a character. For example, in the case of Zelda, you would have a certain maximum number of hearts. Other games use different terminology, but the idea is how much damage can a particular character take before it ends up dying. The current number of hit points we have out of that maximum, and let's go up here and put max on this, max hit points and current hit points. Now whenever we have a function or a set of code that needs to work with a character, we need to pass in all of these different variables. For example, this, this function, display character, will display what's going on with the character, and we need to pass in the name, sex, max, hit points, current hit points, And then we can do a print statement or some sort of graphical display that will show what's going on with the character. In this case, I'll just keep it simple. The actual display isn't what we're really concerned about. If you've only got like two, three, four attributes, it's not really that big of a deal. But if we were to create a more complex game, then this list can get to be rather long. And as we add on to our game, then it becomes more complex when we need to pass this information from one function to another. For example, if I were to allow my character to move faster as he or she ends up gaining more experience or more magic, I might add an attribute like max speed. The max speed is like 10 meters per second or something. Then everywhere I've got a function that works with the character, I'll need to in add in max speed. This can get to be old after a while, and what if I end up working with a multiplayer game? Now all of a sudden, these five attributes that I have, I need to repeat for every networked character that I've got in my game. And all of a sudden, it becomes a, even more complex. In fact, complex enough, it just doesn't even seem reasonable to be able to do with the current structure that we have. Would it not be a great idea if I could take all of these different items and put them into one variable called character. And then take that particular variable and pass it in and not have all of this, but just pass in character. Then if I add a new field to character, it's automatically passed everywhere that I pass the character variable making it a lot easier and a lot less time consuming to add new stuff. Well, the way to do that inside of Python and a lot of other languages is to use something called a class. A class can do this and it can do a whole lot of other really interesting things. But right now we're just going to concentrate on taking a whole bunch of attributes and putting them together in one class.